Hello, you guys doing today? My name is Professor Smellgood, and welcome to Sun Aroma Academy, where I'm teaching you guys how to sell the oils. I want to get right to it, right? Because I've already made a lesson about this before, but unfortunately, I guess some people, they don't want to watch the lessons, or they're not trying to hear me. Don't nobody want to see another MJ, right? The reason why Kobe Bryant did not get all of the props that he wanted was because his game was too similar to MJ. Don't nobody want to see another MJ. It's just as simple as that. Don't nobody want to see another Michael Jordan, right? He's the one, my, MJ is the one who brought that fade away. He's the one who made it up. He's the one who took that fade away and took it to the next level. That, that was his trademark. You feel what I'm saying? Why do you think Steph Curry... Why do you think Steph Curry gets so much uh, gets so much so much recognition? Is is it the fact that he can shoot threes very well? Most people they would say yes, but no, that's not the case. The reason why this man is so special is because how he shoot the threes, how he shoot the threes, which is all he need is a little space, an inch of space that's open to him. Nobody has never ever specialized that before, never. Because back in the day, what they used to do, Steve Kerr, Reggie Miller, etc., uh, John Paxson, what they used to do is they get an open shot. A couple feet open, they got an open shot, they knock it down. They knock it down, right? They create space, they knock it down. Steph Curry, one inch, that's open. He knock it down. Nobody never did that. Just come down the court, pop, pop every single time. Set up no plays. He's the only person to do that, and the coaches will let him get away with that because they know that this is his specialty. That's what he can do. That's his, that's his specialty. He brought something different to the game, right? Why don't you bring something different to the game? Why do you keep doing the same thing that everybody else do? Why? I mean, you, you can't think of anything new. <laughs> You can't think of anything new. Can you think of something new that a person can say, oh, I never seen that with the oils. Oh, I never seen her do that with the oils. Oh, I never heard that sales pitch before. And that's the thing that make my man, uh, Mr. Smell Good, look good. That's the thing that makes him look. That's the thing that makes him so special and makes him so known. He is original and he is different. First person. So he's the first person to bring out this uh, the wagon. He's the first person to bring out the wagon. He's the first person to do that. Everybody that come after him with that is, is following his footsteps. And of course, maybe he don't have no problem with that. But at the end of the day, he's the essence. He's the essence of it all. He's the one who brought this out. You feel what I'm saying? He's the one who brought it out. Right? I give another example. Myself, right? And I'm not trying to brag on myself, but I'm just all facts, man. All facts. It was me who came up with the concept of the bike. The crate on the bike selling the oils and riding around selling the oils. It was, it was me who came up with that concept. I never seen nobody else do that. Nobody do that. I've seen people ride around on, on the bike selling the oils, but I've never seen people with the crate, with the logo. Crate attached to the bike with the logo. Now, it, even if it was somebody that did do that before me, I didn't have knowledge that they did that before me. So in, in reality, it's still my idea. Right? I never seen nobody do that. Why Why you want to do the same thing? You feel what I'm saying? Why would you want to do the same exact thing? Why can't you just be different? Why can't you be different? You see what I'm saying? Why can't you just be different? That's what I'm saying. Don't nobody want to see the same stuff over and over again. Don't nobody, was, don't nobody want to see the same stuff, man. I was the first person to make a janitor's cart at my shop. I was the first person to make a janitor's cart out of an actual mobile booth at my shop. Nobody else has done it before. Like when people that come to my shop and they see the way it looks, Right? They never know. They, they, they can't tell that it's actually a janitor's cart until when I'm actually getting ready to pack up and, 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 and you know, take everything down. And they say, oh, that's a janitor's cart. But I got to look it so nice that they won't even know the difference. 